So these are my secret tools for cleaning the water deposit, hard water stains off of glass shower doors. And I'm gonna show you just how easy it is to do right now. So the first thing I'm gonna do is get my sponge wet. So not saturated, just wet. And I'm gonna do half this door so you can see the actual visible difference. So I'm taking a little bit of Dawn dish soap and putting it on the screen on the green scrubby side. Just a little bit, nothing major. Side that we cleaned this is the side we did not and as we get down here you can see this side has no hard water and this side does and you'll see that visible all the way down to the bottom I'm not pressing hard, I'm just going over the spots where the hard water stains are. You can feel it very much like when you can feel something sticky on a wood table or your kitchen cabinets. So I'm not pressing because I don't want to scratch the glass. And this has never scratched the glass. I've been doing this method for years and it's never ever left a mark. Whether it's been on printed or patterned glass like this or just straight see-through glass, I've never left a scratch on the glass because I'm not pressing hard, I'm just letting the soap take away the hard water. and come back and take a look at the two doors side by side so you can see what the difference is when they're dry and then we'll clean the other door. Okay, so the doors are completely dry and you can see up at the top, there's really not much of a difference because when you have, this one hasn't been cleaned yet and this one has. So I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna get the edge of the wall in there but I'm gonna get you pretty close. I'll put the wall in there so you have some perspective but you can see there's no soap scum on the door at all. The door is clean all the way down to the bottom. And now we're gonna do the same thing on this side and you can see the soap scum in here. Up at the top, it looks pretty clean because the soap comes down and it's as the moisture stays on the glass that you get all the soap scum. So you're gonna have more um, at the bottom than you're gonna have at the top. So like, if I get at the right angle, you can see all of this soap scum down here. Where you, I come over here, you don't have any of that. doors scrubbed clean on the inside. I'm going to let them dry completely. The biggest reason that you get soap scum on shower doors or glass doors is because you're not letting them dry. So when you get in to take your shower, turn your fan on. If you're in a situation where you can, leave your door open. So like if you're in a master bedroom, master bathroom situation, close the bedroom door, leave the bathroom door open and let your fan run at least a half an hour after you're outside of the shower so that that water and humidity can escape fully 
before you turn it off. That will help prevent a lot of this soap scum. Also, you can wax the inside of these doors and the soap won't stick. The water won't stick. It'll just slide right off. Make sure you're only using a paste, not a liquid, and don't get it on the floors. You're going to get hurt. If you get any wax on the floor, you need to scrub it up with a strong detergent because you're going to fall and you're going to hurt yourself in the shower. It's very dangerous, so be very, very careful before you do that. Again, only use a paste. Spread it on, buff it out. The water will be repelled just like it's repelled off of your car. Your shower doors will stay cleaner much longer. But really, when you have something as simple as a little bit of Dawn dish soap and a scrubby brush, it's no big deal. I'll get in, soap up that sponge, scrub down the whole shower. It takes maybe, maybe 45 seconds to do everything top to bottom. Then I just rinse out the scrubber, stand it up to dry, take my shower, and I'm done. So there's no real need to do a deep scrubbing of the doors. If you guys have any questions, let me know. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. Thanks for stopping by. We'll talk soon.